Welcome to our presentation of the WACV submission Real-Time Six Degree of Freedom Pose Estimation by Event-Based Camera using Active LED Markers. We are showcasing the integration of Active LED Markers or ALMs in short with Event-Based Cameras, a powerful plan for spatial localization. ALMs are markers with LEDs blinking at unique frequencies that provide precise spatial referencing. Event-based cameras detect changes in luminosity at each pixel independently, offering data with microsecond level temporal resolution. This combination enables us to achieve real-time, accurate six degrees of freedom pose estimations, excelling even in challenging environments while avoiding drawbacks of standard cameras like motion blur or low frame rates. Join us as we explore how this innovative approach is advancing robotic navigation and task execution. The key contributions of our work are the development of a rapid event-based pose estimation system utilizing active LED markers, achieving impressive sub-millisecond latency below 0.5 milliseconds, coupled with a high output rate of more than 3 kHz. We've conducted extensive analysis in both static and dynamic scenarios, thoroughly examining update frequency and absolute accuracy. Moreover, we've seamlessly integrated the system into a quadcopter for practical six degree of freedom pose estimation tasks, rigorously tested in both indoor and outdoor experiments. This integration showcases the system's adaptability even for embedded devices. The key aspects of our system are grounded in the use of active LED markers paired with event-based cameras for enhanced pose estimation. ALMs project periodic signals onto the camera sensor, optimized by tuning sensor biases for high signal-to-noise ratios, generating a single event per pixel with each LED blink. Our ALM structure with high-frequency blinking LEDs, identifiable by their unique blinking patterns, enables individual recognition. We employ the IPP PNP algorithm for a pose reconstruction based on the known arrangement of LEDs and camera intrinsics. Our approach encompasses four key phases noise reduction with proper bias adjustment, event accumulation, frequency recognition for ALM identification, and continuous LED tracking based on the raw event stream. This methodology not only diminishes latency but also elevates accuracy with robustness to LEDs exiting and re-entering the camera's field of view. Detection requires predefined geometrical arrangement and blinking frequencies of the ALM LEDs, with the best performance observed for frequencies between 4 and 40 kHz. Tracking is performed online, leveraging the initial detection of ALM's LED center points, enabling precise sub-pixel accuracy. Lastly, pose estimation is conducted asynchronously to maximize the update rate. The reprojection area is monitored to ensure stability and signal tracking failures, a crucial feature for maintaining system reliability. On this result slide, we delve into the empirical evidence substantiating our system's capabilities. We gauge absolute accuracy by comparing the ALM pose estimations with the synchronized benchmarks from the OptiTrack system. Our findings highlight a notable position in static scenarios with the absolute position error and orientation error remaining well within the acceptable range as the camera distance varied from 2.1 to 4.8 meters. Notably, larger marker boards significantly enhanced orientation accuracy, mitigating the pose flips observed with the smaller markers at increased distances. Comparative analysis further underscored the superior consistency of our tracking-based pose estimation. We witnessed error margins impressively limited to 1 to 2% affirming the system's robustness. For instance, at the 4.8 meter distance, the maximum position error kept at 87.8 millimeters and the orientation error peaked at just 1.55 degrees. Focusing on latency, we ensured system optimization by prioritizing execution and minimizing background interference, allowing us to measure latency precisely. Our system not only excelled in output rate, 
outstripping detection-based methods, but also demonstrated adaptability by running efficiently on an embedded PC of a drone, albeit with an expected dip in output rate and a slight uptick in average delay due to inherent system constraints. In conclusion, the reduced latency and low deviation from the expected results, primarily influenced by communication overhead, position our proposed method at the forefront, surpassing current industry standards. These results are not just numbers, they represent a leap in real-time performance and reliability for robotic systems. Our outdoor experiments utilizing quadcopters were pivotal in providing the system's adeptness at tracking high-speed movements. With the drone outfitted with an ALM and our event-based camera grounded on a tripod, we pushed the limits reaching drone speeds of up to 10 meters per second. In this case, all the processing was done on a PC. In this live footage, we marked the drone with a red circle for easy reference and included the event camera's perspective on the bottom right. A rapid ascent from 3 to 9 meters was performed. Even with the inherent noise challenges in set direction estimations, our system stood firm, effectively tracking the ALM. The rapid ascent is plotted on the right, solidifying our system's capability in diverse operational conditions. Changing perspectives, we mounted the camera onto the drone, observing a stationary ALM from above. All the processes of marker detection and tracking are performed on the drone. As soon as the drone enters the camera's field of view, the marker is detected and the 6D pose is tracked, as illustrated in the trajectory on the right. Impressively, our system captured the ALM's path with minimal noise, as can be seen in the plot. In our work, we've successfully developed a localization system that leverages an event-based camera and active LED markers designed to eliminate motion blur and minimize computational costs. The system has not only achieved real-time performance with an impressive 0.5 milliseconds latency and a 3 kHz update rate, it has also consistently outperformed the traditional detection-based methods. We've pushed the boundaries of precision in spatial localization, demonstrating accuracy at high output rates coupled with low latency. This marks a significant advancement in the field, bringing forth a solution that is not just technically good, but also adaptable, straightforward and cost-effective. It performs exceptionally well in outdoor and dynamic scenes, offering a robust and accessible option for a wide range of applications.